Hi guys and welcome to Dove Nourishing Secrets presents Body and Mind Season 3 powered by Elaine Farms. It is the season finale sadly and throughout the season I've had many firsts. Uh, I had my tryst with kayaking, parkour, water cooled, I even learned a few capoeira moves. So keeping the whole theme of firsts going, today I'm going to be trying cardio lattes. Wondering what that is? Well stop wondering and keep watching. Alright guys, so I'm with the master trainer and founder of Pilates Academy, the very vivacious, bubbly Chloe. Hi Chloe! Hello, Did Marcus. you like my introduction of you? Amazing. Thank me later. <laughs> Alright, now I want to know a little bit more about Pilates Academy. First of all, how cool is it that you get to do it on a trampoline? Yeah. That itself is amazing, isn't it? I have a trampoline in my backyard and I love it. Uh, tell me a little bit more about what you do here and about Cardio Lattes. Cardio yeah. Lattes. So the Pilates Academy is uh, the only place in Dubai and in the UAE where you can find this discipline which combines the cardiovascular benefits of rebounding, which means jumping on a trampoline, with the postural um, and alignment benefits of and principles of the Pilates discipline and the core strength that comes with Pilates, of course, because it's our signature. Um, you were talking about benefits, so cardiolatis is not just fun, it's a lot of fun, but it also is um, universally recognized, specifically rebounding, as the most effective aerobic workout ever developed. So imagine what happens if you combine those benefits of a rebounding technique with all the alignment principles and the core strengthening of Pilates is like the best thing you can ever do and that's why when I moved to Dubai four years ago the first thing I packed in was like my trampoline it was like I am bringing this to Dubai and I want everybody to fall in love with it. Your trampoline pretty much travels with you it doesn't does, it? And it, it does. And what I really like about it is that there's also a bit of a playful element to it because it's boring to do a workout on say for example a treadmill or just a, or, or a bike because this has that jumping element it to it which makes does. it more exciting. And most of my clients are like they start jumping, they start to smile and they're like, oh my god, I feel like a kid again, let's go! I must admit, the trampoline in my backyard, although we bought it for my daughter, I'm the one who uses it more. So I'm excited to be a, let's get cracking then, shall we? Yes, okay. so a cardiologist class has a specific structure. It starts with some little mobilization uh, workout with some balance and strengthening exercises for the lower limbs, which we're going to do standing on a trampoline. Okay, and this seems easy, but when you try, it actually isn't so easy. We're gonna keep the feet together, yes, ideally a little closer to each other. Grow tall from the crown of your head, yes, open your collarbones and you're gonna bend your knees. When you jump, you wanna keep your spine upright because we wanna focus on posture and then stretch. We'll go one more and stretch. And then the last one. Okay, now squeeze your thighs, engage your core because we're about to come on our toes. Why do we do this? To check lower limbs alignment and to make sure that feet and ankles are strong enough in order to, let's keep going, bend and stretch and then lift and lower in order to jump. Yes, try to maintain those heels close to each other. And the last one we stay up, why not? Let's engage everything and grow. We open the arms, we smile. It's very hard to do this. We bring the arms forward, I know, right? And then we open and relax back down. You know, having a mirror in front of you actually helps it you helps get better posture, it doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Some extra exercises that we do are on a single leg. That's something that we can do together. Okay. Actually, balancing on a single leg can be tough. Yes. It doesn't look like so. You people might think, oh my God, that's super easy, but no, it's, it's not. not. And you might not believe this. You can stretch your leg in front of you, for example. Oh, yes. <laughs> I know. It's not easy on a trampoline. It throws you off so much more. This would be hard to do just on the on the floor. It's gonna be hard on the floor and when you do it on the trampoline it's just super hard but you know physiotherapists actually use trampolines to rehabilitate knees and ankles and hips so that's um, I always have better balance on my on the right side. It's I always can see the that. Case. Yeah. All right. What's so next? the next step will be some core exercises on the trampoline. So we can sit. Should we do something here? Okay. Arms straight in front of you. Collarbones wide and open. We're gonna roll down 
Okay. Very good. And then lift one leg. And then lift the other leg. Very good. Now, squeeze your belly in and draw straight to tap down on the floor, lifting up and tapping down on the floor and lifting up. You need a strong, strong core in order to do this. But what is really awesome is that you can perform all the mat work repertoires, the Pilates on the floor. You can do it on the mat and the mat is kind of cocooning the shape of your spine so that you get a much stronger abdominal connection, which you are feeling, by the way. <laughs> Last one. Okay, and we can sit back up. We're well, moving to the next one where we can actually, can I grab some weights? I'm sorry, I didn't take them before. She's gonna go get some weights for us. Here we are. They perfect. match your t-shirt. Yes. That's perfect. Perfect, oh my goodness. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> it almost blends into my top. Okay, let's do this. Let's step onto the trampoline. You can wear the weights and you can incorporate some upper body work, not just lower body anchor, but upper body here. Okay. So what you can do is that you can start balancing on the trampoline so that you can get the feeling of your core activating. You don't need to jump that yeah. much, but you can start moving your arms. Okay, so whenever we jump, not just the core and all the postural muscles are working, but every single cell of our body is under a greater amount of gravitational load, which means in easy terms, every cell is strengthening. And when you work with weight, the resulting weight that you get is a lot higher than the weight that you're carrying. So it's just half kilos, but it feels like five, right? Yeah, I can really feel it on my calf muscles right now. Let's go. Few more. All right, let's move on to the next one. And then, after we've done a little bit of weight work, you can throw the weights off the scene. Bye, guys. <laughs> and you can start swinging your arms, keeping your shoulders on top of your ribs, your ribs on top of your hips, and start just bouncing a little higher. Yes, what I is, was waiting for this one. What is very special about the cardio lattice technique is that you don't bounce down, yeah. you really focus on posture and alignment, and you think being super light and lengthening your spine towards the sky. Yeah. Look I, at that, I can see I'm, your practice home. Once you're here, you can do, for example, a little jumping jack. Yes, good. And don't forget to breathe because that's also part of the technique, right? Very nice. And then you can twist to one side, feet on one side, hands on the other, and on the other side. Yes. It's like a little dance. And thing. you can, it looks a little bit like dancing, but this is so good as a pre-ski because it's winter season. If you're going skiing, this is also very, very good to prepare for the ski season. Whew, and in a while, I won't be able to talk anymore because I'm out of breath. <laughs> okay. okay. What's next? What's next? Once you've practiced the most, um, let's say, the easiest bounces, you can go up to the challenge bounces. What does that mean? You jump a little higher, you engage your core, and you try to go super high. So you lift your feet up to your glutes, and you touch your bum. Very good. Yes, try not to look down, otherwise you're gonna fall off the trampoline. Or you can get into shapes. Flying, yes. And having fun, because that's, yes, that's it. Let's try together. I feel like we're in a playground. Two, one, two, three, yeah. <laughs> one more, one more, one, two, three. <laughs> ah, so I think we're almost yes. done. No. Yes. I no, keep you want to keep going. She wants to go on. She wants to go on. Right. Well, okay. in order to As finish, much as I want to go on, I think my cops are telling me to <laughs> wait stop. A, so wait a second because it is really actually super important not to stop all at once. But uh, okay, we didn't jump so much. So yes. It's going to be all right. That's a good point. I uh, didn't know that. I, You're not supposed to just suddenly pause. No, it's like you run, 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 and then you stop. Oh. You usually, let's do one big breath together. Okay. Inhale. Right. Ah. And exhale, good. Yeah. How do you feel? I feel amazing because it's so fun. Like it I is. don't feel like I'm working out. I feel like I'm just playing with my friend in the playground. It's, it is. It it's, is actually, it is super effective, but very gentle. Yeah. It is the reason why, and I didn't tell you before because I really wanted to hear about your feedback, but you know, you get 
a higher calorie burning than running mm -hmm. with almost zero impact on your joints. Oh, wow. How cool is that? That is amazing. And typically, how long is a class of this sort? So a class is 60 minutes, of which we jump for half an hour straight with wow. no breaks. And once per year, we have a Cardiolatis Marathon, 90 minutes, only for the bravest. Right, Chloe, it's been an absolute pleasure meeting you. You're such a superstar. I've enjoyed my time, and let's get back on the trampoline and make sure these guys get out of the room, all right? And until then, Bye. see you guys. High five, Chloe. <laughs> I'm ending my day at the Pilates Academy on a very high note. There are so many health benefits of doing such a fun and playful form of exercise. Now, speaking of health benefits, I definitely need to hydrate, but also it is cold and flu season here in the UAE. And what better way than to make sure you take your vitamins with the Elaine Dairy Orange Juice right here. The great thing about this is that it's got no added sugar or preservatives and it's a fantastic way to boost your immunity system. So I'm going to enjoy this delicious drink. You guys go enjoy this break. On the other side, we will be meeting the home chefs. Hi, I'm Sonali Segal and you're watching Body & Mind Season 3. very very important to eat right and drink right and by drinking I don't mean drinking alcohol like drinking lots of water I think that's the basic thing that we need to drink three to four liters of water every day and trust me more than 70% of your weight issues and your health issues would be sorted I would just say that you know we all today uh, live a very sedentary lifestyle so it's very important for us to keep ourselves stretched and uh, yoga allows you to do that and you know it takes care of a lot of your pains and stuff so a lot of stretching and even when I practice yoga uh, you know sometimes when I'm shooting or working I don't get a lot of time to do back in an entire workout so all I do is do basic stretches you know stretch your quads hamstrings everything and uh, I, I think a, a hamstring stretch with your body down is, is great because it releases your lower back and we keep sitting and you know it fixes our posture and all of that so I think um, that that would be my tip and just smile through it all. Welcome back to Dove Nourishing Secrets presents Body and Mind Season 3 powered by Elaine Farms. Now throughout the season, we have challenged some great chefs and featured some amazing healthy and organic restaurants. But today we are going to feature a home service where you can have your own personal chef cook up a storm in your own kitchen. So I'm not at a hotel, not at a restaurant or a cafe. I'm at home with the founders of The Home Chef, Divya and Nick Hill. They also happen to be married, by the way. Hi, guys. Hi. Hi, uh, I'm very eager to learn about this new concept. Tell me a little bit more about uh, Home Chefs. So like the name describes itself, Home Chef is chefs coming to your home to cook food with your ingredients. Mm -hmm. So it's a healthy way that we look into because it's obviously cooked into your kitchen. You exactly know what you're getting made. It's customized to your tastes and your likings. And plus you know exactly what kind of vegetables, what kind of oil, what woks are being used for your cooking. What was the real idea behind uh, the, the, the Home Chef? Uh, to be honest, it is something very personal. We as a couple used to face the challenge of ordering in every single day and oh, what used to it. happen was because we were so hungry by the time you know we're ready to eat it used to be only junk or fast food that used to come mm. at the end so it was something that i was looking for it was my need his need that you know we could if we could find somebody who could just come to my house and cook food for me you know just the way i like it 
something simple, not too much masalas, the oil should be less, just the way we like it. You know, it's, it's funny you say this because my husband and I started off the exact same way. You've literally just stolen the words from my mouth because I've said this before exactly yeah. as you have. Yeah. Now, Nikhil, uh, to bring you into this, I mean, yes. you, you go to the gym, you're big into fitness. Um, how much, uh, for, I mean, for a health freak such as yourself, how much has this concept helped you? I think it's a great concept for a lot of people who go to the gym because we can, our cooks can do a lot of uh, specialized diets as per your requirements from keto to uh, low carb diets to high protein diets as you like. So there's something which can be done and over and above our cooks can do a lot of other cuisines apart from just ghar ka khana. So they can do your international food, they can do Thai, they can do Chinese. So anything and any, everything under the sun mm. and as per your requirements using your ingredients at all. Speaking of an international menu, uh, that's exactly what we have in front of us right now. We have a beautiful spread, all very healthy but delicious at the same time. So I've just tried some of these zucchini rolls. Tell me about yeah. these. So mm. they're grilled. They are very, very thin strips of zucchini which mm. have been grilled with just a drizzle of olive oil and salt and pepper. And we've stuffed it in with uh, goat cheese which is herbed, along with some basil and sun red tomatoes. Mm, and goat cheese is quite healthy, isn't it? It is healthy. All right, so let's move on to the next dish right there. Tell me about those Vietnamese rolls. Can I have one, please? Please, please, go ahead. Uh, so these are the rice paper rolls that um, that are readily available in the market. Something very simple. So these are all different. Um, one is chicken, one is fish. Yeah, no. So we've done one chicken, one prawn. Okay, which is the so, chicken one? I think that is the okay. chicken one. <laughs> so I believe this is the Alain chicken. That's right. So we always recommend Alain chicken because for some reason we feel it's very nice and fresh. Okay. And um, yeah, so very healthy. Everything raw inside except for the meat that has been cooked and uh, just a dipping sauce on the side to add that extra mm. punch. And I think the interesting thing about a dish like this is that you can customize it to literally anything However of your you choice. like. And it is very quick because th there's very little cooking involved in it, there's right? There's literally hardly any cooking involved in this. And plus, you know, we have also done this with fruits. So you can add strawberries, you can add quinoa, you can add noodles, you can add whatever you like. You can do what as you like it. That's interesting. Now finally moving on to our Elaine roast chicken. Yeah. Divya, now I know that Christmas has gone by, but the way you've decorated that plate with the roasted vegetables and the chicken and the rosemary just takes me back to I December. I know. Also because we did this for so many parties during Christmas and it was a big hit. I mean, people loved it. And I think it is a very festive dish. So we do have a lot of parties yes. that uh, we cater to. We have various packages and um, we have options as you like it. We customize for you. And adding more to it, uh, <clears throat> apart from just cooking, these guys also clean before they leave. Yeah. So oh. they're, you're away Perfect. from all the hassle, <laughs> yeah. I would say. I'm sold on that. That last bit that you said, I'm, I'm yeah. very, very sold on this concept. All right, guys, so it's time for us to wind up. Thank you so much for having me Thank at you. your home. And for this delicious spread, you have to teach me how to prepare that Don't chicken. Don't worry about <laughs> it. We'll be sending a guy to your house very soon. I'm going to take you up on that offer. It's been a pleasure. Thank you Same. so much. Thank you. All right, guys, so from one living room to another, we meet a family to find out how they take care of their dental hygiene. See you on the other side. Taking care of your mouth, teeth and gums is a worthy cause in and of itself. And throughout this series, we've met so many different families to find out why their dental health is so important to them. So today we're going to meet Sigil, who is a homemaker and mom to a beautiful one-year-old baby boy. Hi, Sigil. Hi, Shay. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. And thank you for inviting me and the entire crew into your thank home. You you've been a gracious over. host. Sigil, first of all, you look amazing for a mom who just gave birth Dang. a year ago. You look thank fantastic. You. Um, I want to know a little bit more about yeah. you know, some of the natural remedies that you and your family have been following over the years. Uh, well, uh, one thing that I remember the most is my grandma used to make us have this mixture of uh, a few cloves, turmeric and sugar and she used to make us uh, have this drink twice a day mm. and we make sure till now to have it every day. So just we're keeping the traditions alive. Oh, that's beautiful. As we mentioned earlier, your boy is just a year old. Yeah. In, in in the near future, he's going to start brushing his teeth. Yeah. Which product do you trust the most when it comes to your and your family's oral hygiene? 
Well, um, a signal definitely. Whenever me and my husband go out for grocery shopping, we make sure to get this uh, toothpaste because of all the natural ingredients that it has. So yes, definitely this one. Sijil, uh, I believe everything you say because you have great teeth yourself. All right, Thank you and so keep much. rocking and congratulations. Thank and it's so been much. an absolute pleasure meeting you. Same here. Thank you. Welcome back to Dove Nourishing Secrets presents Body and Mind Season 3 powered by Elaine Farms. Now throughout the season, I've been pampered like a princess, floated like a butterfly. I tried some of the most intrinsic Arabian therapies. I even had my chakras balanced. But I've saved the best for last, a truly one-of-a-kind rainforest experience. Not at the Amazon, but right here at the Ritz-Carlton Russell Khaima Al Wadi Desert. After that refreshing and rather playful experience at the hydrothermal therapy here at the rainforest, I'm continuing to hydrate myself with this gorgeous colored drink. Look how pretty this good drink is. Um, it's called the butterfly pea flower drink. Did I get that right? Well done, Ashwarya. <laughs> Fantastic. And joining me is the spa and retail director, Emre. Emre, hi. I'm hi, so Ashwarya. excited to be here. Pleasure is ours to have you with us. You know, I must tell you, uh, before we talk about the actual therapy itself, we have to talk about the property. My husband and I, we've stayed here a few years ago and it's hands down one of the best places, especially for couples to have a getaway. I want to know a little bit more about the architecture and the hospitality because it is very Bedouin inspired, isn't it? Indeed. At the Ritz-Carlton, Rasa Khama al Wadi Desert, we want to stimulate all the senses of holiday makers and staycation favors. And most important part is actually the sense of well-being. We are, we are a property where the character of the property is deeply rooted in this part of the world. And we want to be part of the whole vision of Rasa Karma to be the wellness and adventure hub of the UAE. The actual therapy itself, there are so many different elements that I got to experience today. Um, each has its own benefits and, and you get a different feeling after you finish each one of those. Some are more playful, others are more relaxing. Tell me about the first one, the little walk through with the shower. I felt like I was at a car wash. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's the rain bulk. Yes. And that's the entrance yeah. uh, to our rainforest where you could experience uh, different showers and different temperatures where the water drops are also in different density. Yes. The first one is a warm one and the next one cold, mist and um, heavier drops and the waterfall at the end, again cold, because all our facilities are based actually on balancing, like in life, yin and yang, cold and hot. Everyone likes hot, it is comfortable, but actually the healing part is the cold ones. Mm. It's the cold stones, the cold water, if done with heat together. So the whole rainforest is actually based on this balance and that was also the first station you went through. It's really playful, that's what I enjoyed most about it because it almost awakens the inner child in you because I was just giggling when I had cold water all dropped down me. Um, it was a fun experience and particularly for couples, I think it's a great group activity to do. Um, some of the other elements that I really enjoyed was, has to be the hammam. Typically a hammam is not underwater, but this one was. And then the vitality pool. Tell us a little bit about how the, the whole therapeutic aspect uh, of these two different um, Sure, pools. within these 16 hydrothermal stations, we have the steam baths in uh, five of them actually, and each of them have their own aroma. 
So our guests can choose their preferences and will settle in one of them to bath continuously. Because it's not a marathon. You're not supposed <laughs> to use each of them one or two minutes and walk further. It's more about choosing your preference, wherever you feel more comfortable to settle in and to complete the whole experience. So hammam is one of them. Mm. Uh, it's not the traditional Turkish hammam where yes. you have the stomach stone, the marble hot in the middle. We have those in the treatment rooms just next to the hammam. But our hammam has also the hydro massage facilities because um, when you immerse your body into the water, it's not just that pleasant feelings or the jets treating your body, but it's also a hormonal aspect stimulating. There are so many health benefits of hydrothermal therapy. It's, it's not just therapeutic, but it's actually quite a great activity to do as well. It's enjoyable. It's not your know, sort of mundane lay down, go to sleep sort of a thing. Um, Emery, I've absolutely enjoyed myself. I'm sure to come back again with my husband. Um, it's Ashwarya. been an absolute pleasure. Thank you. Thank you, Ashwarya. It was a pleasure to have you with us yes. and hope to see you again. Definitely. A rainforest therapy in the middle of the desert. That's the sort of thing this wonderful country throws at you. Experiences that you cannot imagine and innovations that set the standard. We hope we've set some amazing fitness and wellness standards for you guys to follow because as you all know, this is the last episode of the season. And as much as I hate saying goodbyes, this is Ashwarya Ajit from the entire team of Body and Mind wishing you guys a wonderful year ahead and amazing health as well.